Hey guys, Mr. Spaghetti here. Coming to you guys to make a video on um how to p how to protect your skin in the winter time. Um, you know when you go outside and it's cold, your skin tends to dry out. Um, the air just sucks out all the moisture from your skin, and your skin gets dry, cracked, chaff, everything like that. So I'm just showing you guys how I protect my skin in the winter, what I use, how I use it, and all that. On my lips because in the winter time for some reason I always get one dry spot on my lips and it's always like right here but um on my lips I use the rose so I bought this um last year around around the winter time I bought it I believe um March or April March probably March like towards the end of the winter I bought it and um this is the second salve salve whatever I bought from Bath and Body. Um, you probably see me use this in all my videos. So this is the only thing I use on my lips. Um, I bought another one from Sephora. Another, sorry, another rose cell. And um, I think this is the best one. I think it's better than the one from Sephora, just because um, it lasts longer. The one from Sephora is um, how to explain? When you put it on your lips and you like rub your lips together. It's more slippery, more slidey. This one is a little thicker. Not really thick, but it's a little thicker. And, um, I like, I basically just like how this is. Um, also on my lips, I will use Andy. I only use this on my lips when I'm in the house and I'm lazy and I don't feel like getting up to get this. I use the Andy on my skin also. Um, this is, um, it prevents and treats diaper rash. Helps heal dry, chapped skin. Protects and smooth minor cuts and burns um it's just an ointment a regular ointment um i gave this to my mom a couple of well last week because her hands are peeling it works perfectly for that um i had like a little burn a rash something there i had a burn on my arm um uh, my legs were cracking everything like that and i use this and to me this is amazing but this comes second to what I'm about to show you, I use um these two babies right here. The oil, you know, it's kind of oily, and the oil gel is more thick. These two work amazing. I've been using this since 2009. Well, I've been using this since 2009. Never failed me yet. Like I'm in love with this. I recommended it to other people, and for me, I realized um, it holds the moisture more in my skin. It doesn't like dry out my skin, anything like that. It lasts much longer than lotion or anything like that, in my opinion. I do drop like one drop or two drops of this in my lotion, just because I can do that. <laughs> but um, I also might drop this in my lotion. It depends on what I have at the time. Um. If you guys haven't read the back of um, any baby products, it has directions. It says to use. On the back of the oil, it says to use gently massage onto damp skin, to damp skin to leave skin feeling baby soft. That's what the oil. You know, you put it not when your skin is dry. It works better when your skin is wet. For the baby oil gel, it says to use gently massage onto damp skin after stepping out of the shower or bath to leave skin feeling baby soft works best on damp skin not dry skin this is how I use it I use both of them every day um no mostly every day um for this I when I like just come out of the shower my skin is still wet I rub the oil on and you notice like if you use it um the oil will seep into your skin and the water will just sit on top of your skin the water doesn't go in your skin it doesn't dry out your skin or anything like that with um the oil gel after I pat dry my skin or whatever, I come out the shower and I use this and my skin is very moist. It's a good luster in your skin. Um, your skin is not, or your skin is oily and your skin will probably like stick to something. I don't, um, recommend you put a lot. I use like a dime or nickel size. Um, nothing too much. I don't use too much of anything. But, um, to me... These help your skin a lot, a lot, a lot. I recommend you use this especially if you are going outside in the um in the cold, you know, before you get ready. Use this on your skin. Um, it will help keep moisture in your skin and it won't dry your skin as much. 
if you live somewhere where it's really, really cold or it's in midwinter, because you know midwinter is like deadly, it's like brick outside, snow falling and snow makes it even more cold outside. Andy, in my opinion, is the best to use. Just because it but it shields your skin from the cold. So even if you go outside and you might feel like it's gonna dry out, it's not really drying out. The Andy is like a shield. It keeps the moisture in your skin. It's so ointment is more it has like this oil, of course.